the rumor mill is spinning. Every few years, Sony drops a camera that changes the game. But the chatter around the A7V sensor? It's different. This isn't just an upgrade. It sounds like a complete rewrite of the rulebook. Thesis statement host. We're talking about potentially putting flagship speed, like 30 frames per second raw and zero rolling shutter, into a camera meant for the masses. The question isn't if it's good, but is the A7V sensor hype or revolution? Stick around because based on the leaks we've got the answer, and it's going to redefine the future of mirrorless photography. The Sony A7 series has defined the modern mirrorless camera. From the original game-changing A7 to the hugely popular A7 IV, each iteration was a clear step forward. But the rumored A7V? Its next-generation sensor might not just be a step, it could be a quantum leap. Is the A7V sensor merely hype? Or are we on the cusp of a true photographic revolution? What's the buzz all about? The buzz centers on one key piece of hardware, a new 33-megapixel, partially stacked full-frame sensor. While the 33MP resolution is similar to the A7 IV, the architecture is entirely new for this line. The original basic but good hybrid, introducing a fantastic BSI sensor for great low light. A 7.4. A bump to 33MP and a significant overhaul to processing and video, but it retained a relatively slow sensor readout, leading to noticeable rolling shutter and a 10 frames per second burst cap. The A7V is poised to solve these core limitations. Ting the stage why this sensor is different. This isn't just about megapixel count. The rumored inclusion of a partially stacked design, technology previously reserved for flagship cameras like the A9 and A1, is a clear statement. It means an integrated memory layer directly behind the sensor pixels, designed for blazing fast data transfer. Pixel architecture innovations, stack sensor and global shutter rumors. The reality, partially stack sensor. The stack design is the single biggest performance upgrade. It's rumored to enable an astonishing 30 frames per second burst shooting in 14-bit RAW using the electronic shutter. This massive speed increase, coupled with the new AI-dedicated processing chip seen in the A7RV, turns a general-purpose camera into a genuine speed monster for action and wildlife. The good news, rolling shutter annihilation. The most immediate, practical benefit for hybrid shooters will be a drastically reduced rolling shutter. The jello effect in video or stills, making the electronic shutter truly viable for nearly all situations. The full global shutter is likely reserved for the flagship A9 series, but this is a huge step. Low light supremacy. Redefining high ISO performance while high-resolution sensors often trade light gathering for detail, the efficiency of a new-gen BSI, backside illuminated, and stack design, combined with better processing, suggests cleaner files, superior noise handling in the raw data pipeline, better detail retention. The new 8-stop in-body image stabilization, IBIS, rumor is another key factor, letting photographers use lower ISOs in handheld low-light scenarios. Dynamic range reimagined, capturing impossible details the combination of a new, faster sensor readout and the powerful BIONS XR processor could push the dynamic range envelope, especially at base ISO. We can anticipate creative possibilities unleash photography without limits action in sports, 30 frames per second burst and pre-capture technology, which records images before the shutter button is fully pressed, means you will simply never miss the peak moment point zero rolling shutter, near zero high speed panning, flash photography with electronic shutter, and fast moving subjects are all now clean and distortion free. This fundamentally changes how a photographer can use the camera. The A7V is rumored to deliver 4K 60P with no crop and an option for 4K 120P, likely with a crop, uncropped 4K 60P, full frame look, better low light, 
and better dynamic range at a high frame rate. This is huge for filmmakers. Flagship AI AF, the AI chip-driven autofocus will provide best-in-class tracking for video, including advanced pose estimation, making solo filmmaking easier than ever. The rumored CFX Express Type A/SD hybrid slot will manage the massive data load from 30 frames per second raw. The current rumor places the A7V at a price point close to 3,000 US dollars. This is a significant premium over the A7 IV's launch price and raises the barrier for the everyday pH. Autographer. It's a tool for the serious prosumer and professional hybrid shooter. The good news here is that the E-mount is mature. All current E-mount lenses will work, but to truly maximize 30 frames per second and the new AF speed, you'll want modern high-speed lenses. The A7V is clearly gunning for rivals like the Canon R6 Mark II, which also excels at speed. However, no other camera in this class offers the rumored combination of a partially stacked sensor, 30 frames per second 14-bit RAW, and next-gen AI AF. The ball will be in the competition's court to respond. The A7V is a clear winner for three groups, a 7.3-A7-2 upgraders. It offers a monumental leap in performance, action-slash-wildlife photographers. The speed and AI AF are transformative, hybrid filmmakers. The uncropped 4K-slash-60P and superior rolling shutter performance are a must-have. The partially stacked sensor in a $3,000 body is the paradigm shift. It proves that flagship speed is trickling down to the mainstream. This move will fundamentally redefine the minimum performance expectation for a modern full-frame hybrid camera. When we weigh the rumored specs, the partially stacked sensor, the 30 frames per second 14-bit RAW, the near-zero rolling shutter performance, and the uncropped 4K 60p, the answer is undeniable. Host. The Sony A7V sensor is not hype. It is a revolution. It's taking technology once reserved for the $6,500 flagship Alpha One and bringing it down to the prosumer level, fundamentally changing what we expect from a hybrid camera. But the true impact will be felt in your hands. Are you excited about the prospect of this speed? Does the rumored price point make you hesitant? Let me know in the comments below. Will the A7V be your next camera? If you found this breakdown helpful, please hit that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into the future of camera tech. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.